Happy New Year! I mean, oh, happy birthday. <laughs> January 1st is what the system's firmware is set to on the Nintendo DS, so that's what it was set to on no dollar GBA here. Anyway, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough! Yeah, I'm so happy to be back to playing this game. I was just waiting out the whole content ID thing to see how things were going and whatnot, but this is YouTube we're talking about, and there's just... You never know how long they're gonna take. <laughs> so let's start stage three, Chili Dipped Cove, and play the first stage, Snow Starfy. So yeah, this is an ice world, and... Oh, 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 why am I starting in the water? So cold! So cold, Mo! Oh, let's, let's get out of here! Well, we've come a long way, but it's freezing cold! The shell's chattering! If Starly was here, we could wrap this up and get out of here fast! What do you think? I don't need help! I can't even do it! No! Local connection! Oh, Dude, cold! So very cold! Break these! With three star spins! Oh, jeez! Oh, buddy! I'm gonna have to acclimate to the cold eventually. Oh, currents, icicles, not good, not good at all. Whoops, oh, Xbox D pad. They should have improved the PC one too. I would have bought that. <laughs> Why? Why must they have made a D pad like this? And these uh, snow penguins here, you can destroy like that, and then penguins will rebuild them as such like that. Isn't that adorable? Well, actually known as mini pings, and this uh, one that's walking around that can actually hurt you is known as a pingoon. Oh, and they're, they're all really easy enemies, and just let's go buy them, and let's slide through here, because there's ice physics, and that's completely useless. That's a starly-only area, basically. Uh, I can't get up here, can I? No, I didn't think I could, but I can. Oh, I can get on this. Stand on the back side of this when you push it forward, by the way. It makes it a little bit easier to avoid any clips if you're standing near the front of it. Like, sometimes when you're on the front, an enemy can touch you and it'll still hurt you. But when you're like this, it is perfectly safe. Mm, I think we're near the... Oh, shoot. Okay. I, my body's definitely acclimated itself to the cold again. Okay. Well, not again, just already. It's I'm good now, I'm good now, although some things kind of cracked off, but it's okay, I'll just... It, they're already in cold, so they should be good, and I'll just get them surgically reattached. We'll, we'll be good to go, and Mo is... Mo Sniffer is going like crazy. We gotta find the secrets. Oh, shoot! No! I'm not that rusty. It hasn't been that long since I've played this. Let me destroy all the ice. Actually, I don't think there's anything here except for pearls, but pearls are nice. Pearls are good for buying stuff. Mm, yeah. Oh, I think I think the thing that I'm looking for is over here somewhere. Oh yeah. Oh, and these are bobfish, by the way. Those like sunfish-looking things. Yeah. Mm, they're very easy enemies as well. In fact, a lot of the enemies feel like reskins of other enemies. Ah, there's the chest. I thought it was wrong there. I got Globertos. No, this is probably the most he's go most dialogue he's ever gonna get from this point forward. <laughs> Try tapping Starfy and Mo on the title screen for a surprise. Also, the more stages I forgot about that surprise actually. Also, the more stages you clear, the more guests will show up on the Mo Show. You know about the Mo Show, right? Oh, actually, I didn't show that yet in the walkthrough. Keyword yet. The Mo Show is basically like a talk show of the characters in the game, and. Uh, uh, it can have regular character—I I should say hero characters, some supporting characters, as well as enemies, so that's always pretty fun. Oh wait, doesn't that other current lead me to, um, like, through a multi-path sort of thing? Oops, I'm gonna have to—yep, that's what I thought. So back around I get—I I go I, Back around I go again, not a go. That was just terrible wording. <laughs> and through the—oh shoot! New enemy! Well, at least I can go back. <laughs> There's those little seals down there are chobies. See that? Oh, they're just they're just there to be cute in this particular spot. They really don't do anything. They're just there to greet you. They're they're the door greeters of this area. I will say, if you don't mind. All right, Globerto, what do you have to say? 
Ah, Starfleet, the water may be cold, but my passion for maps still burns hot. Want to go to the map? No! And you see, yeah, he still doesn't have all that much to say. Ah, uh, that's okay. He does uh, change his dialogue for uh, each world for the most part, so I guess uh, he, he will have something new to say, per se, at times. That's why I keep talking to him. <laughs> I know I complain about the heat, but this cold is worse, I tell ya. Hey, Bunston, you don't even look chilly. What gives? My spacesuit keeps me quite warm. If it ever gets too hot, I can just... Oh, jeez. What's that? Sounds like an avalanche. Starvey, look out! Woo! It's not an avalanche. It's... A snowball and there's a the controls. Just, yeah, you just press the B button to jump, and that's all you can do basically. You can also bounce off of walls, but I don't really recommend doing that unless you know what you're doing. Uh, like over here is kind of essential, <laughs> but what I'm saying is that in, in terms of getting stuff, I guess. All right, and now th this is this is actually quite a difficulty jump. Whenever you get to these snowball parts. Because it's very easy to fall into a pit of death. Like, right now, this is pretty much just automatic. And by the way, your jump, it's its pretty stiff-looking, I guess you could say, in that it, it goes up really quick and comes down really quick, so your, the distance of your jump isn't all that far. So keep that in mind as you do your stuff. Alright, here's where stuff gets tricky. Just keep concentrating, and just jump carefully. Oh boy. Oh jeez, down is death. Down is very much death. Aha! Safe. For now. And some of these get really thin too. Oh, like this one. Like this one. Oh, the oh, Made it. <laughs> so happy I made it. And I think this is the end of the course, actually. Well, after I destroy a couple more critters. Woo! Woo! Get on the ground. Get on the ground. You need to be able to jump. There we go. Woo! Okay, I guess I didn't have to jump there. And we're done. Yeah! You okay, Starf? Whoa, you look a little dizzy. How many moles do you see? <laughs> I can't believe Starfy is all right. Wow, what a ride. Who were those penguins? I don't know, but they sure weren't friendly. Let's keep looking around. That does sound like a good idea, but oh jeez, I'm still dizzy. Still very, very dizzy. Oh, oh, oh. <sighs> Okay, I'm good to go again. You guys, you guys got anything else to say here? Starfy, you were really on a roll there, eh? Huh, that kind of looked fun. You don't want to try it out, Bunston? I can make a big snowball for you if you want. Oh, no, I was just kidding. No need to be for me to be rolling around anywhere, thanks. <laughs> Alright, let's save the game. And continue on through this icy wonderland. And, oh, wait, wait. Uh, just, uh, for some reason, whenever I see a new enemy, I just immediately, like, I'm used to walking past them quickly before even, even introducing them, but that's a sea gulp. Yeah, a sea gulp. Sort of like a parody of sea gull name, but they don't even look much like a gull, aside from their uh, coloration. And yeah, this snow acts sort of like quicksand, and stuff can be hidden inside it, as you are seeing right here. This also can lead to secret path, <coughs> paths at times, so be sure to check that stuff out as you go. Anyway, I think I have 100% of this stage. And yes, I did. Woo! Sweet! Okay, because of the whole content ID thing and the whole the whole thing, I don't know if I'm I'll get a random strike one of these days because of the content ID match thing. I think what I'm gonna do for a while is keep videos under 15 minutes, and uh, if I play another level, it's surely gonna go over 15 minutes. So I think I'm gonna end it off here and just leave one level apart like this. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in the next part.